All right, so before we wrap, <clears throat> wrap up this uh, section and assign the homework, uh, <clears throat> I've got a um, another uh, file that y'all can practice with. Um, <clears throat> and so if you look at, um, in Canvas, I will post this file called Velocity Directions. Velocity Directions. Uh, so, <clears throat> for um, <clears throat> these problems, uh, many times we're looking at the middle, the middle bar here, bar A, B, you know, that's, it's on one side it's connected to the, this link, on another side it's connected he here <clears throat> to a different link, or maybe it's in a slot or something. So, as you're doing this VB equals VA plus VB slash A, um, it's important to, to, to know, to be able to know the direction for the velocity at point A and the direction for the velocity at point B. Uh, so here, this uh, file called Velocity Directions is for you to practice <clears throat> uh, specifying what's the direction for point A uh, because either maybe you're starting here uh, and you need to do that first uh, before you get to the relative velocity portion of the problem, or inside the relative velocity portion of the problem, uh, you might need to go ahead and specify, hey, I don't know the velocity of point B, but I do know its direction, right? In, in this case, <clears throat> I don't know the velocity of point B, but I know its direction. It's all in the I direction, right? Because, because it's at the top, of, and it's connected right here. So uh, go through this PDF and you know look at this one and then <clears throat> and then switch to the next page and so this shows the directions. Did, could you tell and did you know that the velocity of A was down at that 30 degree angle? Right? Did, did you know that the velocity of B was perfectly horizontal? Um, now again this does <clears throat> th those velocities kind of are are constrained, those directions are constrained, those directions are defined not by that middle bar AB, but by the links that it was attached to on the ends. Okay, so let's look at the, the next one. So here, you know, I know the heart of my problem is bar BC. Uh, you know, I'm going to do VB equals VC plus VB slash C. All right, but uh, <clears throat> before I get there, I need to Go ahead and find the velocity of C. Do you see that the velocity of C would be perfectly to the left right there? Uh, but then also, uh, I don't know the velocity of point B, but I do know its direction. Right? Do you know the direction of velocity of point B? Yeah, it is down at that 30 degree angle. Right? And those directions are not controlled by the middle link. Those directions are controlled by the outer links. Uh, so anyway, go through this PDF See if you can view it one page at a time and then flip to the next page. That would be helpful uh, and for you to do that. If we were in class, we would do this on the glass boards. Uh, really fun. But um, we can't do that. So try it on your own, specifying the directions on each end of those um, of, the, of that middle link. So it's called Velocity Directions. I'll post it as a file uh, in Canvas. Um, <clears throat> And that's what we had been doing, right? We th this one was was very easy. We knew that this one velocity was just in the i direction. Now, be careful. That is not. Sometimes we have these um, these pistons that are just moving out, uh, as opposed to uh, links that are going in a circle. Uh, but so here, the velocity right here. Let me draw in a different color. Velocity right here is all in the j. Velocity right here is at 30 degrees. What about this one? The velocity is constrained, control, controlled by that, that link <coughs> right there. And then B is just in a slot. So you know that direction of its velocity. How about this? And this one was, is the uh, maybe most important problem. Uh, did you see and did you know that the velocity of B is at that 60 degree angle, it is controlled by this link AB? Uh, and the velocity of C is, we got lucky, it, it, we were at the very, very bottom of that disk. Uh, so it's perfectly <clears throat> in that direction. So make sure here, this is a good one, velocity of B is right there. And I think that's the only thing we know uh, for that one. 
And then the last one, yeah, these velocities are just controlled by slots. Sometimes velocities are controlled by slots that they're in. <coughs> Sometimes it's connected to a disk. Sometimes it is connected to a link. Uh, but knowing and going ahead and being able to say, okay, I don't know VC, uh, but I do know its direction. All in the I direction for that problem. Uh, so knowing the directions of velocities uh, is important.